I used to craft my dreams with lovely things I could get my hands on. Pearls, lace, sparkles, a bit of fragrance from dried lavender that I picked from my mother's garden. But right after I had one dream perfected, beautiful like a happy bride, a lady would come at night while I was deep asleep, and she would steal it. And the more I tried to recreate it, the more the memory of it disappeared. Then I would dream a new dream, crafted with lovely things I could get my hands on. Flowers, charms, a dab of perfume that I made myself from rose petals that I picked from my mother's grave. But as I was deep asleep at night, she came back and stole my beautifully crafted dream away from me. And the harder I tried to retrieve it, the further it dissipated. Some friends told me to just stop dreaming. So there would be nothing left for her to steal from me. But something told me that my role is to craft dreams, and her role is to steal dreams. I have crafted countless dreams, and my old friend, the dream thief, has stolen countless dreams. One night, I pretended to fall asleep. She came because I had just finished embellishing my newest dream with a sigil that I picked from Erish Gigal's garden. As she was about to steal it, I grabbed her by the wrist. I looked at her, not with anger, only with curiosity and joy, as I had grown love and admiration towards her. After all, her loyalty. Light and mystery have been keeping me company. She said to me, "You may not get me, but I know you trust me. Your dreams have always been safe with me. Your dreams have always been perfected and delivered to you when you least expect them, and sometimes in forms that you can never even recognize." I am the dreamer, and she is the dream thief. Well, not really, but you know what I mean.